It's time for another mass unboxing today. What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, and we have a box here filled with tons of stuff from Glorious. They said this box is gonna contain a bunch of new peripherals and hardware and accessories for their current lineup, as well as future stuff, which I can only assume means there's gonna be a lot of, you know, different plates and color accents for the GMMK Pro and some future things coming out. So today, against all odds, we got three cameras, one, two, and three. You should see the craziness of cables I have going on behind the scenes since obviously this sort of setup is not made for a three camera setup, but it doesn't matter. Let's hop right into this and we'll see what all we have. Oh yes, definitely definitely packed today <laughs> all right so first right in front of me got a little uh gift bag here probably like oh okay okay probably some so to say information no <laughs> this is nice this that's nice i wish okay so i just had a child recently in december we got some uh teethers here nice little soothing set i wonder who from gloria sent this over that's an, a nice little Nice little touch, could appreciate that. Obviously this is not keyboard related stuff. We'll hop into that in a little minute. Some uh, pacifiers, we'll grow into those. And we do have a card. Okay, I wonder who I can thank, who this is gonna be from. Uh, it says, to your family from the Glorious family. That is very nice. There's no name, so I don't know who the individual is who put this together, but thank you very much. A nice little appreciated and thoughtful gift as I drop it. Always like little, you know, things like that. Uh, good to see the companies, you know, are paying attention to the outside life, you know, outside of YouTube. So, nice little touch. I, I definitely appreciate that. Uh, first up today, looking like we have some pink, pixel pink aura mechanical keycaps. So, these are their pudding shine through keycaps, but now we have them in this pink colorway up top. Uh, you know, not me, not my style necessarily, but I guess these are brand new. I had no idea. Pink pudding keycaps. Okay, that makes more sense to go along with their GMMK Pro pink top frame. So like I said, they've added some new uh, releases and things to their GMMK Pro lineup, including a lot of new colorways, which here we have the pink top frame. Um, so if it's just a top frame, yeah, I was gonna say, I assume it wouldn't be, you know, the bottom and stuff or any actual plate. So an actual pink top frame. Should have uh, thought before I spoke. And, okay, so we have the GMMK2 right here. We'll hop into that in a minute, because I also see some extra color frames right here with a blue, aqua blue, and a forest green. Okay, so these are probably um, also gonna go along with their uh, keycap sets that they released at the launch of the GMMK Pro. So this would look really nice with those, I assume. Again, both colors here, a forest green, aqua blue, three colors as of now will there be another one really not too sure because honestly like when they um announced they were putting out in different colors and stuff i didn't look too much into it so so far just pink green and blue i assume though that's probably gonna be um the the bulk of it right like what other colors will they put out for red maybe probably maybe yellow to match their colorway but hold on you guys Oh, I can't show you any of this in any of the cameras right now. This is under NDA, I assume. I'll have to look when the embargo lifts for this. I forgot they were doing this. And, oh baby, I am pumped for this. I am pumped. Be on the lookout for something coming up. I assume, I'll have to check the embargo. I think it was sometimes in April for that, but I completely forgot about that. Oh yeah. All right, hopping back in, I see a pink. Okay, so again, we had their uh, cables in the past that they put out different colors. Now a pixel pink. Put that over there. Any other cables? No, but I do see some knobs peeking down here in the corner. So safe to say, since we have the bulk of these three here, uh, these are the three new colors with a cable, plate, and now rotary knobs. So you guys know the rotary knobs that were, you know, on the top right-hand side of the GMK Pro. And now if you want to spice it up, add a little bit of color, you have 
all three. And actually what I did on my GMK Pro build was I picked up um, like guitar knobs and added them as a nice accent piece because there's tons of different, you know, styles and designs for these guitar knobs and they fit on there just fine. So that's what I did for mine. Uh, but now again, cool to see we have different colors coming out. And let me just see what the actual difference here is in this GMMK Pro. I didn't think they were sending me an, an entire GMMK Pro unit here. Huh. So I wonder what the difference is with this. It says black slate. I had both the black and the arctic white, which was more a silver. So is this just, I assume, like is this fully pre-built then? Let's take a look. That's interesting. Again, I didn't know what was coming in this box. They just said it was a bunch of accessories and upcoming stuff. I didn't think too far into it or too much into it. So let's see. I assume, yeah, this is probably going to be a fully pre-built one. Slate black. Ooh, okay, okay. Just from like touching this and opening it, I could feel nice switches. I wonder what they are. But yeah, I'm um, not too sure, you know, at first glance, what the actual difference is uh, to this is gonna be versus the one that we had last year. I assume there's some modifications. I know we have an accented keycap here, nice white. Huh, maybe there's no, okay, so we do have some, let's see. Okay, no real information on that. You got different gasket strips here for modding. I wonder what these actual switches are. It shows it on the box. So let me actually just close this up for a second. Uh, it does show on the side right here what we get. So yeah, this is, I'm trying to think because you know, when I had these sent out, uh, sent out last year, they were obviously the bare bones kit. They, oh, that, that you see? I don't do my research before these unboxing videos. I avoid looking at, you know, uh, the press releases and the briefings and stuff to make these more, you know, just kind of candid and spontaneous, but now it makes sense. These aren't the bare bones, or this isn't the bare bones because that's what was released last year. Now, year one, we have the new colored accents and top plates, as well as the availability to buy this pre-built. That's the difference. Now it all makes sense. Comes with a coil cable, comes with keycaps, switches, key switch, and keycap puller. So what key switches are actually inside? Does it tell me pre-lubed Glorious Fox linear? Huh, those are definitely new. I, I know that. Let me pop a keycap off real quick and see. Okay, so the red pre-lubed Fox linears. They do feel really nice. Um, I'll say I've used their Glorious Lynx switches as well, which were also lubed. These kind of feel on par with that. Maybe they're, I would say these are possibly a little bit lighter. Not too sure, I'll have to check the specs on that. But okay, so this is a part of their pre-built GMMK Pro keyboard um, offering now. I wonder if there's a way you can go in and also like customize if you want different colored keycaps and stuff, or if you have to buy that all separately, or if white just comes on the black, I'll have to look. But cool to see we have this now. I'll put this again off to the side. And looks like we have the newest of the bunch. Move this out of the way. Toss that all behind me. And yes, the GMMK2, which is the full size, and the GMMK2 compact in pink hmm that's gonna make for an interesting review i would have preferred you know not pink because again for me and my channel and just the, the aesthetics and stuff when i'm filming um just pink really isn't my style but okay so these are fully pre-built as you can see right here it says pre-built edition on both so i assume they're also going to be offering these as well as a bare bones so you could again buy your other accessories and build it up yourself so yeah the fact that it says pre-built i assume would mean that or else i wouldn't have put that on there so let's hop in real quick and check out the jim mk2 compact and their full size 96 percent all right, we'll hop into the pink one first. Again, um, with pink switches as well. So it actually, it looks pretty damn nice. We have 
Again, they're Fox linear switches in here. Uh, a new logo as well. So they're going through a rebranding, I would assume, because now on the custom escape key, um, in that like yellow orangish colorway, which does not really go with the pink at all. I assume there's a regular pink escape key in here. Uh, but yes, we have the Fox linear in here. Okay. Sounds nice. It does, they do feel really nice. I'll have to check the specs on these, but I do like them. And you know, honestly, it looks pretty nice. I'm not the biggest fan, you know, just first reaction to the two different uh, materials here because that more metallic aluminum top plate really sticks out, has a nice like shimmer to it. And then you just have like a, a matte lighter baby pink uh, right underneath it. And it's still visible from all the sides and stuff. So I'm not the biggest fan of that. But yeah, a great compact 65% option. I know with their original Jim MK keyboards, we had the compact, which was 60, then they had a 75 and a full size. So introducing a 65% still compact keyboard here. And let me just, you know, double check with the accessories. Yes, you do get a color matching pink cable, which is always nice to see. And like I said before, we do have that pink escape key because that, while it looks cool, I like the new logo. Uh, it's just, it doesn't go really. <laughs> and a key switch and keycap puller in there. So now we will hop over to their full size 96%, which does have a smaller footprint, definitely noticeable right away than a traditional full size keyboard. You still have your numpad here on the right side, your arrow keys, but yeah, it's more compact. I do like this footprint, man. This is a, this is pretty nice. And yet again, I assume we have the uh, Fox linear switches. Yes, and I, want, I do wanna check on the box to see if these are pre-lubed or not. Um, obviously on the more expensive premium option with the GMMK Pro, you would assume they're pre-lubed. And uh, let's see, I wanna check, let me close this up real quick. If it tells us on the back. So yes, switches, pre-lubed, Fox Linears, we have pre-lubed Glorious Clip-On Stabilizers. Didn't even think to check the stabilizers. So these are also pre-lubed. Very, very interesting. I'm not gonna lie. I, you know, I'm not a full-size keyboard guy. I'm definitely a more compact. You know, my, my go-to really is a 75%, but also um, when you have something like this, this is also like, this is probably my ideal. This and a TKL are my go-tos, you know? Uh, and this really, in terms of footprint, like I'll just show you guys, not that different. There's what, two extra rows here? When you're looking at them side by side like that. So the footprint is really compact, even on a full size option. Definitely cool to see. This is taking me by surprise. Do a little stabilizer test real quick. Yeah, these also feel and sound really good. Okay, definitely an improvement from their previous lube stabilizers. All right, Glorious. So this, the GMMK2, obviously not a full uh, review or anything, more so just an unboxing. But again, to recap, besides the new GMMK2, we have the pre-built GMMK Pro. Really liking that. Uh, oh, can't say what it is. That other thing that's coming out in a month or so that I'm super pumped for that you don't know about just yet. And the colored accents and stuff with their prism pink, aqua blue, and forest green rotary knobs, as well as the color matching forest green, aqua blue, prism pink top plate for the GMMK Pro. I'll have to do a swap and see how it, like, it looks on here. And uh, just like, you know, how it looks in the contrast with the black top uh, or the black bottom and the uh, new colored top as well as some pixel pink aura keycaps as well as a pink glorious cable so now my question is and again i don't look any of this up up beforehand are they gonna also have a forest green aura pudding keycap as well as a uh, aqua blue pudding keycap option out there huh yeah that'll be something to keep an eye on I'll do a check and stuff but that should do it guys for this little unboxing of a mass glorious hardware accessory and new release box of all the goodies hope you enjoyed you know th these little unboxing videos and i switch up from content i don't gotta do much work roll three cameras talk to you guys very very chill and informal 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 
you get the idea. So hope you enjoyed. If you're pumped for the reviews of the stuff coming up, let me know by giving the video a big thumbs up to show your support. Feel free to follow me on Twitter, at RandomFrankP. And lastly, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.